We play. We fight. We conquer. Welcome to the Freak Show, ladies and gentlemen. It is Wednesday, and on Wednesdays, little known fact, I, your host, Bumpy Big Squiggums, has an energy goblin that just follows me around and sucks out my energy all Wednesday long. It's awful. I hate it. And by the time I got to do the thing that I got to do in the evening on Wednesday, I have no energy. I'm super tired. I can barely stay awake. It's awful. I hate it. I don't know why. Doesn't really happen to me throughout the rest of the week. Energy goblin Wednesdays, I guess. <sighs> anyway, Octopath Traveler 2. I get through this. I get to take a little bit of a nap. It's not going to help much, but well, we'll see. Maybe I'll survive what I need to do. All right, so we have Ochet and Akali. I think that's what we named our uh, fox, our jackal friend. Um, yeah, so we can capture creatures, and then we can summon them. We can provoke people into fighting us by attacking them with monsters that we've summoned. And we can eat the monsters and turn them into jerky and things. It's it's weird. She's a really weird character. Really cool and strange and also horrifying and scary. I I don't I don't I don't know. I don't know my thoughts on on Ochet. She's uh unique. She's very unique. Uh, so I like to think that we don't see it somehow. Like we we block it from our minds. So when she like captures like like the King Iguana, for instance, right? Or Mr. Iguana or Giant Iguana Man or whatever it was. Anyway, when she got the, caught the big lizard, I just like to think that she like either has this giant net or like a big bag, and she's just like dragging it behind her, like, <laughs> and we just don't like it's there. We know it's happening, but we just choose to ignore it. Like in my mind, I think that's the funniest way that she has all these pets. You just see this big bag with like different limbs and spikes and arms and heads and stuff, kind of. Not poking out, but like you see the outlines of them in this bag as she's dragging it along behind her. And nobody says anything. They're like, and she walks by and she's like, hey, how's it going to chat? And then she goes, what was with the big bag? I don't know. It was freaky, right? Yeah, it was real weird. You know, something like that. Anyway, that, that's that's how I'd like to perceive this. Um, what what are we what are we doing? <laughs> Sorry. Oh, right. Uh, something about. Oh, we gotta go talk to the guy with the lunch and stuff. All right, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh huh. Um. Yep. I don't think I want to do that, but we'll talk. Stomach full, happy, happy, joy, joy. Uh, delicious jerky. Thank you. Yeah. Not how I feel about that, to be honest. Oh, hello. Liking chicken, liking fish, liking hunting. No chats hunting. Worst poetry of all time, friend. You need to work on that. All right, you guys got anything over here? No? Humans come, Ochet here, not worried. I feel like being able to just murder people with my aminals is uh, kind of a scary power to have. Oh, there's another uh, save point just over there. Interesting. You will not enter my house, sir. Human scary, always angry. This is true. What you got for me? What you want? Um. Oh right. Uh. Okay. Step in the right direction. Okay. And then this is a much better variant. Oh. Oh my God. Ah, oh, it's so funny. Sorry. Uh, I don't know if you guys noticed the the trade system here. Uh, we don't trade in money. We trade in jerky. This is such a horrible society. I don't want any part of this. I mean, don't get me wrong. Meat's delicious and it's wonderful. And yes, eat, 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 eat. It's great. But yikes, man. Yikes. Jerky's so good. All right, oh, sorry. Let me rephrase it. Some jerky can be good. But I found that I'm like... um. Uh, I don't, I don't know what the, like, you know how, like, if, if you like sophisticated whatever, right? You're like a, a food snob. What's the opposite of that? A food hobo? I, I'm like a food hobo when it comes to jerky. Like, the cheaper and nastier it is, the more I like it. Like, you give me, like, a Slim Jim. That stuff nasty. I, it, it, you know, it, it real like, you squish it, it's orange, right? Like, it's bad. It's really bad, but it's so good. And then you get, like, high-quality, really good jerky. 
And it's good, it's just, I, I, I prefer the bad jerky, you know? I don't, I, don't, I don't know. My wife bought, I don't know why, I, I don't know why I agreed to it. I thought it was going to be really... Huh? <laughs> Especially the leaner bits. I thought I was going to be really, 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 really happy with it and enjoying it a lot, but it turned out I really didn't care for it that much. Um, she bought like a bag of jerky from like these professional jerky makers and it was like $50 or something for like a pound or $30 a pound. It was some absurd price. And I'm like, oh, uh, she's like, you want some? I'm like, I mean, I love jerky. Sure. And it's just, there was not much there. And I'm thinking, why don't you go find me like a $2 a pound jerky? And let me eat that. I would like that probably more than I like this stuff. Uh, anyway. Tasty stuff, especially the leaner bits. You tell him, Ochet. Yes. Meat hunted by an apprentice always has a special savor to it. Turn it up a little bit. And today's quarry was a king iguana, I gather. Uh-huh. I mean, didn't you see me have it and chop it up? You are a true hunter, Ochet. Your bow preserves the forest's balance. And my axe. Let's not forget that. <laughs> I do my best. I'm getting pretty good at this, right? Not just hunting, but also talking. Yeah. I didn't spend all those years copying your example for nothing. Ooh. Ochet has grown strong. If we could just do something about her appetite. Yeah. Ten years since the two of you met, is it? Oh? I still remember the one I didn't choose that day. I'm sure it still remembers you, too. I looked all over, but never did find them. Well... Put that out of your mind. What happened that day was fate. Anyway, I gave Akala enough love for both of them. <laughs> Good to hear. I have ruled as Warden of the Isle for many years now. Sure. But I will die one day. Oh. Just like the creature that gave us this meat. Is she gonna hunt you? Let's hope that's a no. When that day comes, Ojet. The island will become your burden to bear. That seems like a weird transition from a guardian lion sentient demigod. I, I don't. I don't know. Whatever you are, uh, to some small girl. Yeah. Uh, I don't know, Master Juva. That sounds kind of heavy. A hunter has to travel light. I'd rather keep going out every day to hunt up some good eating. Some good eating. I see. Tell gotta, me, gotta have you noticed eats. the change in the forest? Uh-oh. Hmm. It's like the whole forest is afraid. Probably because you're murdering everything in it. And eating it. Uh-oh. Warden! Warden! Oh, no. Well, now, what business has the chief of the human village here? Forgive my people for what they did. Oh, I she... came to offer this by way of apology. She don't, she don't sound, she don't, she don't sound like a good person. Just saying. Definitely don't eat that. I did not think you had such humility in you. Don't do it, dude. It makes me uneasy, if I am honest. State your true business, Kohaze. Of course. You are beasts, after all. Uh. You have a nose for these things. Oh, boy. A young girl from our village wandered into the tombs of the Warden Beasts. Uh oh Danger stalks those ruins. 
Humans who enter are never seen again. The music is so good. But this is not the case for you who were here on this island before. Will you enter the ruins and find our lost girl? If you bring her back, I am sure we can reconsider the question of our land. Do you take me for a fool? Those ruins are crawling with monsters. Our kind has no guarantee of return from them either. Okay, yeah. You ask us to risk our lives for a human. That girl had her fate, oh. as do we all. Accept it and return to your home. Wow, okay. Not what I expected. I'll go. Well, um, I want to think about oh, that. Chet, what are you saying? Remember what you taught me, Master Juva? When it matters most, be true to your heart, not to your eyes or nose. Oh, that's a good way of thinking about things. But you know how dangerous the ruins are. And this is a human child. In time, she will repay your kindness with hate. Yeah. Human beast that's not important now i think this is one of those times that matter most and my heart tells me to save that girl sure very well go i am in your debt beastling yeah you are my name is ochette Oh, and leave that meat here. If you cared half as much about your <laughs> own life as you do about meat. Come on, Akala. All right. Well, that was make for the tomes of the Warden Beast and save the lost girl. All right, well, talk to me. Never thought the Beastlings would actually help us. Please find the missing girl, Beast uh, the O Chet. Hello? My apprentice, you must always be true to your heart. That's exactly how he sounds. We all know it. Um. Okay. Do, 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 do. Should I buy something? Probably, but I won't. Wait, it's down this way? Oh, energy goblin, stay away. Do 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 do. All right. Um. Hunt or be hunted. What? Oh, it's a frog. Here we go. I think. Or is it, is it Jar Jar Binks? Maybe. I, uh, could be a frog. So he, he's holding his bow with one hand. He's got his finger pointed out. He's got the the arrow knocked, pulled back. But he's pulling it back with his tongue, and he's looking at us directly. Okay, that's weird. To be sure. Um, get him, Akala. Yeah. Oh, we actually did get to see one of his uh, weaknesses. He don't like axes none too. You know, I'm gonna I'm gonna hit him with a, a bow just because. <laughs> I'm hungry. All right. Cool. Wait. How do I get to there? I want that. And I shall have it. You, aw, the Akala came with us. That's kind of cool. Inspiring plum. You have inspired the plume. Oh. 
Oh, jellyfish. Here we go. Right, this might go badly. Um, kind of skills. Uh, two, two, yeah, okay. Pew, pew. Yeah. See that? Mad skills all up in a mad abundance. Ow. I got slapped. I did I, I did not approve of getting slapped twice Let's in go. the face. Thank you. I think I gotta go for the triple. Uh oh. We're getting slowed. A lot. Here we go. We have eight turns of being slow. That's not great. Yeah, well, let's go for it. I captured you. <laughs> Ouch, my face. Please stop. Let's go. Provoke. Oh, restore health. Yes, go jellyfish. Oh, he gave me a big old smooch, sort of, in a weird way. All right, let's hit him with this. I'm gonna get health back this turn as we continue to get slower and slower and slower. Uh, we're up to nine turns now. We're gonna go ahead and provoke the blue jellyfish. Come out, give me another quick uh, 100 health slap. Thank you. Fairly well, sire. And then we hit for, okay, let's say 30 again. Only this time. We said good day, sir. And I suppose we could capture it. Because then we can have uh, whatever skewer they were just talking about there. Now let's we can grab some food. do a thing with uh, some stuff and be fine. Alright, cool. It's not going to be weird at all. I'm going to eat one of my jellyfish. Ooh, can we get some peanut butter and then we can have peanut butter and jellyfish sandwich? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. An island skewer, why not? Yeah, sure. Alright, well, we, okay. Wait, how does how does one get up there? Apparently like that. Oh, we just picked up the unerring ring. Uh, equipment. Sure, why not? 20 accuracy. Take it. Do, 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 do. Can't go that way. All right, and we're gonna get attacked again. Hey, it's whatever that is, a snail thing, kind of. My prey awaits. Just curious. Okay, I'm like just out of curiosity. What happens if we just like go straight in on them? How? Okay, really, you get the double double on me. All right. <laughs> Not enough. Over here. Oh, you here missed. We go. Oh, you're gonna put nasty breath on me. My prey awaits. Beast lore provoke. Go on, then. Heal me up a little bit, please. Holy. I didn't enjoy the stank, the stank breath. Good, you missed. All right, now we go for the capture. Uh, ooh, rotten meat, meat, uh, expel sputum. Ugh. You know what? I don't think I want that as, you know what? Sure, why not? I'm sure my opponents will feel the same. They probably don't want sputum expelled at, uh, expelled at them, so. Okay. All right, um, I guess we're going to go behind the beautiful waterfall. That looks really cool. Look at a slightly obscure. Ah, oh, it's so nice. This game's so pretty. All right, we got treasure chest over here. Oh, we got some more money. Uh, sorry, jerky. Ready to be prey? I don't want this guy on my side. Here, I'm going to bonk you. Oops. 
Okay, apparently does not care about archery. Not weak to it. Oh, we killed him too quickly. I, I wanted, I actually wanted that. Hey, maybe I should walk around for a second and see if we can get it. Oh, I'm going to try it. I want one of the, the little frogmen. Froggy. Yeah. All right. Cool. Let's go. Uh, let's hit him with the sputum. Come on, then. Smack. What? Did that slow him? It did. Okay. My prey awaits. Uh, yeah, we'll just do this, and then we'll capture him. He shouldn't die from that. Uh, beast, capture. Oh, he's only at 30%. Okay. Um, provoke. We'll do the jellyfish again. Do I get to go before he breaks out of being broke? Nope. He might be slightly stronger than the last frog that we battled, too, to be fair. Hopefully that's enough to kill him. He, he's, he's in red uh, health and he's broken. This should be 100%. Yeah. Oh, he's in yellow health. All right. Shoot all and we get jerky from him if we want to take him out, now which is money. So it seems like it's just, if we're staying in the beast land area, it just makes sense to capture everything and not actually try to kill any of it. I don't know how many things we can actually have captured. Oh. Hmm. Hmm. Yep, the human smells uh, coming from this way. Can't be far now. Alright. Alright, cool treasure chest over there. Interesting one over this Hunt way. Oh my god, what the heck is Let's that? Go. Uh, you know what? Kala, do, do, do a thing. Yeah, there you go, buddy. Uh-huh. Um, capture? Yeah, sure. Island Skewer Rolling Slash. Man, we are really lucky in RNG. Considering how things normally go for me, that is uh, pretty shocking, to be honest. I don't often do well with RNG. It's, I, I very rarely do well with it. So I have to admit, this is uh, probably the game that I have had the best RNG luck out there. Right. All right. Peace lore capture. Shambling. Oh, we got a salad. I guess. Okay, we got a couple of healers now. I don't know which one's uh, gonna be better. The jellyfish or the sa salad monster? The salad mander? <laughs> we got a bone. Guess we go down and around. All right, we're about to get attacked. Yep. Ooh, look at these little frog boys. All right, folks had uh, requested that I up the game speed a little bit, so we're going to try 2x for now. Because, uh, you know, I, if it's if it's just absurd, like, I I generally, like, we'll just say a Disgaea, right? We, I played a lot of the Disgaea games. I usually start slow, and then eventually I up the speed, up the speed, up the speed, up the speed. Uh, there's still to a certain point, same with like Battle Brothers, a certain point where I just don't want to go too much faster. So I rarely go at max speed, and I know that will still drive some people crazy. But I don't mind checking out like a, a slightly higher level. So let's let's, uh, let's see what we got here. Yeah, that seems fine. Yeah, you are. All right, I'm just going to take a, a quick peek. How fast go. can we actually go? Oh, it's just 1 or 2x. All right, that's fine. I feel like 1.5 would be where I'd like it personally, like, for all the time. But, 
Alright, let's try the shambling weed and see what actually happens here. That's a, that's 100 health as well. So either one of them kind of do the same thing. I'm going to, to capture him, by the way. Capture... yep. You're gonna become jerky at some point. Very curious to how many people we can stuff in our, uh, our capture bag. I think we hit him with a three piece and then we capture him. Oh! You cannot take any more beasts. Uh, prepare one of the beasts you've already captured to make room for your latest catch. Sure. That's so disturbing, man. Well, the answer is like five or six, I guess. Sharp nut. Alright, so we did that. Wasn't there another one? How do we get down there? Hmm. Well, you know what, folks? Uh, it's time to break it off. Let's uh, let's get into one more battle. Ready to betray? And uh, we'll, we'll defeat the uh, salad monster here as soon as we can. Beast, uh, provoke. What have we not seen yet? We haven't seen a rolling slash. Let's give that one a shot. Come on, then. Ooh, 167. Not bad. Alright, shambling weed. Yeah, we'll just do that again. Ah, we got a salad now. Yep. Whew, I'm hungry. And that was us defeating it and getting the, uh, the capture from the defeat, which is nice. Alright, next episode we hopefully can figure out how to get into this little alcove to our right. Which I cannot promise we'll be able to figure out or to do, but we're going to hope. And, uh, yeah, we'll continue Ochet's little story and uh, exploration and all that wonderful fun stuff. So, hopefully you guys are all on board. Uh, I had a blast. Uh, again, I know we didn't accomplish too, too much, but, you know, uh, every journey begins with a step. Where we've we're multiple steps in now. We've we've gone through several, and we're going to continue our adventure. Uh, thanks everybody for enjoying this. A uh, lot of positivity, a lot of uh, just I don't know, nice comments and just fun stuff with this one. So it, it's uh, it's made me smile. It's been uh, it's been a joy to be able to. I, I'm really enjoying the game itself, but uh, seeing folks respond to it positively and uh, voicing their opinions and so on and so forth. And it not just being hateful, which I, I don't get a lot of that, but just uh, just just being positive, it's it's been great. So I appreciate that. Anyway, folks, till the very next episode, I have been your host, Bumpy Squiggums. Thank you so much for stopping by the Freak Show. We play, we fight, we conquer. <laughs>